Well, I guess I'll be going now. Ash, Clement, Bonnie. Let's keep in touch from time to time. Serena, I'll definitely come meet you again when may I become a trainer someday. Yeah. Ash, I'm so glad I was able to go on this adventure with you. You're who I strive to be. I'll definitely become a splendid lady next time we meet. Yeah. Well then, goodbye everyone! Hey, Ash! There's just one more thing, is that alright? Huh? Sorts of things. <sighs> Ash, you're really dense, you know? You don't even understand what's happening right in front of you. First, close your eyes. Once you have shut both of your eyes. Now, the first smile that comes to your imagination is the person you care about the most. understand this feeling I've had forever now. Now I just need to put it into words. Yes, now hurry, before it's too late. All right, I have decided. Serena! Ash? I finally understand my own feelings. That's why. Once I become a Pokemon master, I'm going to marry you, Serena. And a sudden proposal? Ash is so bold. What, did I do something wrong? Because whenever Bonnie meets a great girl, she always asks her to be Clement's bride, so that's why I... Normally, all you have to do is tell her that you like her. Ash, you really continue to exceed my expectations. Serena didn't respond. Did I scare her? Uh... Bonnie, say something quick! You caused this! What? But I don't know! Then you really have to become a Pokémon Master! <laughs> But in order for me to become a Pokémon Master, you may have to wait a very long time for me. Are you willing to wait for me? I will wait for you! <laughs> I'm willing to wait a lifetime for you. <laughs> then let's both do our best! Goodbye, Ash! I will definitely do my best! Goodbye, Serena! Well, I guess she's gone now. Come on, Pikachu! We now have to put our best foot forward and getting stronger! Pika, Pika! We can't let Serena wait too long! Then how about a battle with me first, then? That's exactly what I want, Clement! Pikachu! I choose you! Oh, uh, here we go! In my kitchen with too much heat She got my flappy jack slipping No matter what I do, she wanna scramble it 3 a.m. and the pot's still stirring For all I know, she won't see me till the morning Going round and round till she gets away Oh, here we go I'm 
done with you. Come with us! It's okay, Akari. I'm never a cry! We'll become strong together! I believe you. Useless. You won't escape me now and roll back again. All I know is that the grease gets better when the skillets hop and dish sticks together. You see the kicking's done, but it never ends. Nostalgic. The Colos region. Ash of Pelletown has arrived. It's been ten years since we last been here, Pikachu, and it hasn't changed a bit. Let's first head to Lumio City to look for Clement and Bonnie. Sounds like trouble! Let's head over there now! Tyrannitar <laughs> Eevee! Could it be stealing Eevee's food? A hyper beam? Oh no! Pikachu! Save Eevee! Quick! Ninja? Is that really you, Greninja? It's me, Ash! Don't you recognize me? I've always thought about you, Greninja. Have you been doing well? I'm sorry, I spent all these years working towards a becoming a Pokémon Master. That's why I never got the chance to come visit you. You don't blame me, right? Greninja? You're right. I can't believe I would forget. Our hearts will always be as one. Greninja. <laughs> Play. Pikachu. Long time no see, Ash. It's you! Squishy! I must apologize to you. Apologize? It's all thanks to you for leaving Greninja behind to help. In the last ten years, Greninja has worked rigorously in maintaining Kalos. Especially three years ago. All impurities brought by Team Flayer's Mega Weapons have been cleansed, and peace has returned to Kalos. However, protecting this hard-fought peace requires great strength as well. And that is how Greninja became our representative. Always protecting the Pokémon in the Kalos region. I see you're still as righteous as before. Since the problems in Kalos have been resolved, I can now rest easy. Actually, my return this time isn't without a purpose, but with a favor. Greninja! Will you agree to travel with me and take on the challenge to become a Pokémon Master once more? Cha! Just leave this place to me, old friend. Just go ahead and return to doing the things you love the most. Hmm. Cha! 
Mm. <laughs> For a long-awaited ten years, the fated date has finally arrived! And what will go down in world history as the Battle of the Century! This is a battle between Kalos' two strongest trainers of all time, with the Kalos Lee Champion's title on the line! The battle that was made ten years ago might finally be realized today! They've come a very long way. You can definitely learn a lot from watching this very battle. This battle would be almost similar to the one ten years ago. And now, let's welcome Kalos 2, all time strongest trainers, onto the battlefield! In this corner, wearing a red cap with his trusted first partner Pikachu by his side! Labeled by millions to be the one closest in becoming the Pokémon Master of our generation! And here we have someone who is labeled as Kalos' strongest champion in all of history! With his trusted Charizard by his side, they have yet to taste a single defeat in the last 10 years! Seven-time league champion, Ash Ketchum from Kalakau! And the undefeated King of Kalos, Champion Ali! I am Ash Ketchum, of Ballot Town! In the last 10 years, I worked towards my dream to become a Pokémon Master! Today, I will win this battle, and become the Pokémon Master! And with that declaration for victory, Ash roars into this fight for his 8th and final regional league title! Despite the title of Pokémon Master on the line, Ash is undeterred and is brimming with immense confidence! Honest, haven't you arrived yet? Because Ash should not be here now! She even had to perform in the cancer region yesterday. She took a play right after her performance. She should be arriving soon. Her schedule is definitely packed. Even she's the Kalos Queen and the international star. Selena, please hurry. This match could potentially determine your mind how happy is. This match would also determine if Ash is able to become the Pokemon Master. According to history, only if you've gathered all the packs you in every league's Elite Four and become every league's champion, therefore earning all eight league titles. Would you then be worthy of being called the Pokemon Master? But because of the difficulty, no one has yet to achieve that title. But today, Ash could actually achieve that title. In the last 10 years, Ash has tirelessly challenged every region's champion. As of right now, Ash has already Kantos, Johto's, Owens, Sinnoh's, Unova's, Alola's, and Galar's champions. Right now, Ash only has Kalos left, and he will finally become a Pokémon Master. However, Ash's opponent of all the regional champions is Alon. Alain is empirically the strongest amongst them all, being undefeated for almost a decade. His Mega Charizard is simply unmatched. Previous title match against Kalos champion Diantha, no one would have thought that Elaine would only use his Charizard. It managed to defeat all six of Diantha's Pokémon. With that, he then became the Kalos champion we know now. In these ten years, no challenger ever managed to defeat Elaine, no matter what strong Pokémon they sent out. It was futile. It was six versus one bloodbath. Elaine only used his Charizard and beat them all without needing to bring out the rest of his Pokémon. That's how his Charizard earned the title, the Dark King. This match day has both sides requesting for a 1v1 battle. The stage used for this match is the ground battlefield. I can finally have another battle with you, Elaine. I may have lost to you 10 years ago, but today I will definitely win. 
You have absolutely no idea how long I've waited for this day to arrive. I actually have no interest in the League at all, but I became the champion for the sole purpose of battling you one more time. I know your dream is to win all eight Pokémon Leagues and become a Pokémon Master, but I will definitely not hold back in this Pokémon battle. I wouldn't have it any other way! Only when I beat you at your strongest, would I then be able to truly call myself the Pokémon Master! Greninja, I choose you! Could only be Greninja. I choose you, Charizard. Let's go, full power. Ah! Let's go. Ah! The iconic legendary transformation, Ash Greninja! Respond to my heart, Pistol! Transit Evolution! Mega Evolution! Oh. The main Charizard has Mega Evolved! Ninja for you. It's always been the fastest. Thanks, but you haven't seen anything yet. Over there. Aerial Lakes. Charizard. All right, now let's do this. Double team. Wish! Blast burn! Use water shark into the shield! This is simply amazing! What a match this is turning out to be! The heat of the battle has covered the entire field! Greninja seems to be alright! Water shark is holding up the flames! It isn't over yet! Blast burn, stage two! Charizard! Ash, I'll let you witness the move I perfected solely for defeating both you and your Greninja. Dragon Dance! You actually learned Dragon Dance? Dragon Dance? It's a move that raises Charizard's abilities by many levels. I think he used Blast Burn to form a huge firewall. Charizard really used Dragon Dance at the most opportune moment. Yeah, it used Blast Burn to restrict Greninja's movements. Not only will Charizard be able to avoid Greninja's attacks, it also gives Charizard more speed to power up with Dragon Dance even more. This tremendous boost in Charizard's speed won't give Greninja the chance to counter Charizard's now stronger attacks. It's a 
brilliantly thought up plan. This truly is a lot. Seems like he was really looking forward to having this battle with Ash. However, such a tactic will be useless against Ash. Ash and Greninja's mind and soul are one in harmony. Greninja! Throw Water Shuriken onto the ground! Charizard, quick! Use Dragon Dance once more! I'm in trouble if Dragon Dance is used once more. Ash! You need to stop it! Greninja! Use Water Shuriken! Dodge it! Jump, Greninja! If you have an aerial battle with my Charizard, you have no chance of winning. Dragon Claw! Avoid it quickly! The Greninja can't move freely in the air! Full power! Flamethrower! Who says just because you can't fly, you can't win an aerial battle? I'll definitely tear apart that atrocious fallacy! Water shirt and the maneuver about in midair. Your Charizard will be defeated that easily, right? Yeah, my Charizard is trained to not know defeat after all. Whoa! The Dark King still has a wallet! Charizard, spread your wings and soar! Greninja! Water shirt into Kingdom Come! that jump pattern. It was back when he was a Froakie battling against Grant's Onyx. He used levitating rocks as springboards, but to think he'd use his own water shurikens instead. Actually, it isn't easy at all to perfectly execute such a maneuver. One would have to perfectly calculate the angle and rebouncing elastic trajectory of each water shuriken along with the position of the opposing Pokemon. But even then, such calculations aren't the most difficult. The most difficult part is, Ash would have to perfectly time the execution of each jump with the ninja in order for this move to be successful. This sort of high-level maneuver can only be achieved by Ash and the Ninja alone. And Ash has carried this vast amount of intelligence over his last ten years of traveling around the world. Eradicate those water shurikens! Flamethrower! Oh. <laughs> it's a pity you weren't able to land a hit. I can celebrate too soon! Barrage of water shuriken land a hit! With each consecutive blow, you can't predict the outcome of this battle! Will the Dark King finally be defeated here? No! Not even close! It's still spent after all those hits! Your fate is sealed! Oh no! Dark Dark! Seismic Pulse! Face Greninja! Follow up with Blast Burn! This is to be expected of a championship battle, but this is just too exciting! The entire field is set ablaze, and so is my mind! Which side will come out on top? Oh, it's the Dark King! I'm sorry about this, Ash, but your dream ends here. Can Ash Greninja hang on? I'm not sure either. They moved just now. Serena, what are you doing? If you delay any longer, I'm afraid... My dream is not only my own! It's a promise oh, I swore to her! That is why I swear I will become a Pokemon master!
Walker. You're the only one able to excite and push me so far. You've been my strongest challenger in the past ten years. This is the battle of a lifetime. Thanks for your praise. You are one of the toughest champions there is to face. You are also the only one worthy to battle Charizard at his true strength. Charizard, use Dragon Dance to reach your true potential. Did the Dark King not get down, but it showed its true form. This is really the undefeated Kalos champion, Charizard's full power. How scary! He's even stronger than Leon's Charizard. Can he even be beat? I'll show you just how I'm gonna beat you. Dark Charizard! Understand. I now know why Greninja cannot just use four, but eight moves. And Draco Meteor on top of that. Those aren't real moves. It came from Greninja generating a special aura. Nani? You found out. Since you found out, I might as well tell you. All those moves that you've seen before all come from the same style. You can call it an imitation. It's called the Pseudo Force. Pseudo Force? But that's a super high level and sophisticated move. How in the world did they do it? So that's why. The Draco Meteor wasn't a real Draco Meteor, but it borrowed the properties from Pseudo Force to be able to achieve a similar effect. So Rock Tomb, Stone Edge, and Seismic Toss were also possible because of the same reasoning. Though it isn't a real move, it's still able to be replicated to a certain degree. But it still shouldn't be the same as the original. But it just doesn't make any sense. There shouldn't be any similarities. No, there could be a chance. I'm afraid it's because Greninja is able to grasp its full potential to such an extent. It's able to control and manipulate the moves at will. One move that defies all reasoning. The rule just isn't able to comprehend your abilities. But it requires immense strength to achieve such levels. Can it truly be done? Of course! It's my Greninja! This Greninja is originally very special with incredible potential. He's able to sense every single movement and fiber that's around him. To overcome the many obstacles that come his way. By protecting the Kalos Ninja alongside the Zygarde, Greninja was constantly honing his abilities for the last 10 years. As a result, Greninja's abilities evolved to what is now known as a Pseudo Force. On top of the strong bond that Greninja and I share, with our hearts as one, our power increased by exponential folds. You're really opening my eyes to the world, Ash. It's no wonder all of the champions of all seven other regions have lost to you. This is truly the battle of a lifetime I've sought for. However, Charizard and I have sworn to become the strongest ever! 
Which is why we refuse to lose to anyone! Grab him, Dark King! <laughs> it's useless! <laughs> it's time to end this! Let's go! Never fulfill your destiny. Failure. All of this time you've wasted your... This time, his opponent was just too strong. Also, synchronization's always been a double-edged sword. Prevention's injuries will be reflected 100% back to the trainer, even those that are fatal. Is Ash... Ethan?
finally get to see you after all these years! Ash! Serena? Am I... dead? I'm sorry. It looks as if I may not be able to fulfill our dream. Don't fall into despair, Ash. Even if I haven't been by your side these past ten years, I have always followed your achievements. I know that you've always gave your best no matter what. You always kept getting back up. So that's why I believe you will fulfill our dream. Serena, even after all this time, you have never lost faith in me? Nope. Now get up and keep going, like you always said. If you never try, then you'll never succeed. You're right. You aren't the only one in this fight either. <laughs> Greninja! Ash Ketchum, you are the trainer that I have chosen. From the time I saw you when I was a mere froki, I knew that you were the trainer that I've been waiting for. I trust my judgment. However, I trust you more. Only you can take us to the unknown heights that you and I promised that we'd achieve together. <gasps> then let's go, Greninja! We'll take your damage. You really are amazing, Ash. Charizard, this battle isn't over yet. Early on in this battle, massive amounts of water vapor was produced from Charizard's heat and Greninja's water colliding. The heat made the water vapor rise up and form a rain cloud. Greninja activated Torrent pushed the vapor to the brink, causing a heavy storm. But by activating Torrent, it means that Greninja has little HP left. If he gets hit by that Charizard, he'll be out of this battle guaranteed. Ash needs to end this battle now! Pikachu! Pikachu, you got my hat? Thanks, buddy! You don't have to worry about me anymore. So now, we want our gathering death! Greninja, rush past Charizard! Ah! Flying through the air, Charizard! Yo, Dragon Claw! What? Greninja disappeared! Is he using Double Team? What exactly happened? Why are all these water droplets floating in the air? Has time actually frozen in place? No, time isn't what stopped. It was the rainwater. No. These rain droplets aren't natural. They're pointing upwards. All of our dreams. We're putting all the thoughts. All of our hopes. To the 
has one final strike! has gathered up all that rainwater into a giant shuriken. This is the final blow for our tree! Please! Ash! Run! We won't lose either! Charizard! Ninja! Water! Shuriken! Blast burn! We won't be defeated! The Dark King is unable to battle! Greninja is the winner! The champion has been defeated! As has it, we have a new champion! What? I've forgotten how long it's been since I've begun my journey. How much time has passed since I left Pallet Town? I've become friends with so many different Pokémon. so much across the land with them. In our travels, we had a lot of good times. had a lot of bad times. And there were times when I thought I would never reach my dream. But because of a certain promise I made to someone, it gave me new hope to keep trying. 
even when I thought that I would lose. As long as I thought of that promise, I would always get up for myself, my Pokémon, and her. Even when we weren't by each other in real life, our goal were one and the same. We would work hard every day, little by little, to achieve our goal. And now, finally, on this day... We have a winner! The new champion of the Kalos region, Ash Ketchum of Palatow! Ash has now become a champion of all eight regions! Yeah! Ash Ketchum has really become the Pokémon Master! Congratulations, Ash! You finally made your dream come true! He won! He won! Ash won! Way to go, Ash! Bravo, Ash! Ash was able to combine common sense and imagination and use it against Elaine. Today's a new page in the history of the League. He did it! My boy, the Pokémon Master! Oh, 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 you and Greninja truly are the strongest trainer in Pokémon Pain. And now, you become the world's Pokémon Master. However, I hope you don't think our next battle will end the same as today's. You better be ready. Always! We definitely won't lose! Let's give another round of applause for this historic moment, and to our new champion, the world champion of all champions! Pokémon Master Ash! Ash Ketchum of Pelotow! Pokémon Master Ash, can you please give us a few words? Uh, okay. W well first, I want to... I want to thank all of my Pokémon at home. And um, and then... Uh... Uh, her! Serena! Oh yeah! It was because of her that I was able to stand up again! She literally saved my life in my darkest hour! Hey! Serena! Ash? Do you still remember the promise we made ten years ago? I finally become the Pokémon Master! Promise? Wait, you don't mean... Wait... Ah! Is he really gonna say it? Everything is being broadcasted across the world! So... Serena, are you still... willing to marry me? Proposing during a worldwide live broadcast? <gasps> Propose? Ash is really bold. Not hesitating to speak his mind. Well, that is Ash's personality. <laughs> Wait, Barry! This is unexpected. Pokemon Master Ash has just proposed to Serena. Not just any Serena, but the actual Kalos Queen Serena on live TV. What? Shut the front door. It really is the Kalos Queen Serena. But she isn't responding. She's in the audience right now. Will she accept the Pokémon Master's marriage proposal? You are the most amazing person I have ever known. You didn't even have to ask. <laughs> I always knew that I'd choose you, Ash. Mom, I can do this myself! No, Ash, no. You're always so clumsy. What if you couldn't tie your tie? You don't have to worry. I'm not ten years old anymore. Even if you're all grown up, you will always be Mommy's little sweetie. I've only been able to see you grow up a few times after all the years you've been traveling the world. Yeah, but I came home this time to get married. But still, your mother is very proud of you. But I still feel a little lonely. Mom! But now you have to remember, since you're married, you must take the responsibility of a husband. Also, do not put battles before your wife. Serena is a good girl, so you have to show her all of your love. Also, make sure you visit me as often as you can. Also, about your health. Mom, I got it. It'll be okay. It feels just like yesterday you were born in Rhyhorn Racing, and now, now my daughter is getting married. 
but you still spoil me sometimes. All right, we're all done now. What do you think? You don't like mom's taste in fashion, but she has a good sense in hairstyling. I love it, mom. Thank you. I wish you years of happiness with Ash, Serena. Thank you. I will, mom. Pika! This suit fits you well, Pikachu. Pikachu! You look really handsome, Pikachu. Mr. Mime! Mr. Mime! He said there's a lot of people outside to greet you. Mr. Mime! All right, Pikachu. Let's go see everyone. Congratulations on your wedding, Ash! Everyone! It really has been a really long time, guys! Thanks for coming all this way for my wedding. Well, the Pokemon Master is our friend, so of course we would come to your wedding. I never would have thought Ash would find love or get married before any of us. I'm so touched. I've regained my hope of finding love one day, too. <laughs> Susie called your office this morning asking how you were, Dr. Brock. Ninetales misses you, too. I can't wait to see Serena in her wedding dress. This wedding indicator is my latest invention. Aldrul, the best picture of you and your bride. Allow me to record the happy memories for you. As a wine connoisseur, I brought the best wine. Old Ashy Boy the Pokemon Master, hmm? I don't believe it for a second. Well, you better believe it! If you don't, then we can battle right now and I'll show you! Become the Pokemon Master? Ash is still the same as always. He's still such a kid. Alola! Kiyoi, I've heard you're an Island Kahuna now! Yep, soon I'll be coming for your title. I also brought some special Lolan snacks. If you have time, please come back as a guest speaker to the school. Lily is the school principal now. Not as good as my company being your sponsor. <laughs> it can't be! <laughs> <laughs> Charizard! <laughs> Squirtle! <laughs> Butterfree! <laughs> Primate! <laughs> Gotra! <laughs> Abipom! Pidgeot! So you all knew about my wedding? I'm really touched! Thank you, everyone! <laughs> I'm glad to see you all here too. <laughs> You were the one who brought them here? Thank you, Charizard! Hey! Bulbasaur! Squirt, squirt, Bulba, Bulba! Now, who could that be? So this is the cake you all were making! It's really beautiful! Thank you all for all that you've done for me over the years, guys! It's thanks to all of you that I am a Pokémon Master! Hey! Hey! Wait! <laughs> I never expected the Dwarf to become the Pokémon Master and get married! Now that they're focused on the wedding, we have the chance to take all of their Pokémon! Wah! Wah, Buffett! Team Rocket can now enact their plan has been 10 years in the making! Let's hope you know who didn't show up to the wedding, also. Thank you for being our wedding efficient, as well as letting us use your place for the wedding ceremony, Professor Oak. No need to thank me, Ash. It's been a very long time since it was this lively here. Seeing you and Pikachu like this reminds me of the time when you first came to my lab. Back then, the child who came to my lab in his pajamas as a new trainer <laughs> is now here, ten years later. Not only as a groom, but as the Pokémon Master. I could have never done any of this without you, Professor Oak. No need to thank me for your success. This is a result of all your hard work. But you must know that the world is a large place, larger than what we know. There are still many places, many regions, that we don't know about in this wide world. There is still a lot of new and undiscovered Pokémon out there, just waiting to be discovered. So you have to keep your curiosity and love every now and then. Always be the person that you want to be, Ash. Of course! You know that I definitely will! Ah, here she comes! Serena, I'm sorry that I made you wait so long. I'm sorry I took ten years to fulfill our promise. It's okay, Ash. I said I'd wait a lifetime for you. And I never lost faith that you would complete your dream. Ash, do you take Serena to be your lawfully wedded wife? 
whether it be poverty, illness, difficulty, pain, wealth, happiness. Yes, I do! No matter what happens, I will never leave Serena! I do too! No matter what happens, I will always love Ash for the rest of my life! It's really happening! And they really do complain each other. Okay then, I admit that you vowed to each other. Now please exchange rings. They got you! <laughs> now, new groom, new bride, Ash, you may now kiss the bride. Serena, I'm going to kiss you now. Ash, don't be so nervous. This isn't our first kiss. decision of my life, Serena. Me too. Marrying you is the best decision of my life too, Ash. Under the witness of everyone here, I declare you formally as husband and wife. <laughs> 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 completed your dreams. You both can take a break and plan your next adventure. Actually, we don't plan on resting. Like what Professor Oak said, it's a big world out there. There must be hundreds of other Pokémon out there that I never see. There's still a lot that I have yet to learn. As long as there are new Pokémon out there, my dreams will never end. So, have you chosen where you want to go on our next adventure? Yes, I already have. Thank you, Serena. But first, I think it's time I visited my old man. He and Go left this rainbow feather behind last time I saw them! Don't worry, Miss Ketchum! I'll take care of Ash! Mom! We're heading off now! Wait! You're going off so soon? Ah, uh, I want to go too! Okay! Wig Bunny! <laughs> Come on, you guys! <laughs> Let's go on our next adventure! 